Horse Life is a nationally recognized provider of elder care and support services for seniors and their families in Palm Beach County. Located on the expansive Maryland and Stanley M. Katz Seniors Campus in West Palm Beach. Horse Life is dedicated to enhancing quality of life for older adults through a full range of services. Morse Life provides long-term care, state-of-the-art short-term rehabilitation, luxury independent and assisted living, memory care, and home health services. Morse Life is also the exclusive Palm Beach County affiliate for PACE, the national program of all-inclusive care for the elderly. Morse Life has been awarded the Governor's Gold Seal of Excellence and is a five-star nursing facility committed to continuous research and training that consistently delivers enlightened senior care. Morse Life also offers concierge care for clients seeking an enhanced level of private home care. For more information or a tour of the campus, please call 561 471-5111 or visit www.morselife.org And we're back. This is, I've actually been watching the date for this show for about the last three weeks. You have been? When Renee and I decided to do an Ask the Expert show, First of all, you got to have the experts. That's the hardest part is finding the experts. The best of the best. Yes. And i tell you what, we just lucked out when it came to assisted living, home care, senior living. We got the best. I mean, we have got, without a doubt, in fact, it's so great that we've had calls, people calling us and saying, hey, I called Morse Life about my mom or my dad. And, you didn't tell us they're sold out. There's a us. waiting list. There's a waiting yes. list. Yes. So why don't we introduce the CEO and president of Moss Life, Keith Myers. Welcome to the show. Oh, thank you very much. Always a pleasure to be with you guys. Seems like it's been years. but It uh, has. I know. It's, awesome. it's great to have you, you back. This. We started this about eight months ago, and Moss Life was the first person to say, hey, that's a great idea. And well, Keith is very smart. Yeah, <laughs> and we're going to find out for the, over the next thirty minutes how smart he really is. Well, I want to mention if you'd like to watch today's show, you could go to their website. It's www.morselife.org. Yeah, don't forget dot org. Right, or you can it's go not to dot this, com. Or you can go to the station what, to www.wwnnradio.com. We're also live there today. You can watch us. So, so tell everybody Keith. a little bit about your background. And Morse Life. Okay, my background, I am a licensed nursing home administrator, and I've spent over 25 years in the healthcare arena doing, I'm being an administrator of hospitals, participating in home health agencies, and now having the best job in the world, being the president and CEO of a great organization called Morse Life Health System. Do you ever pinch yourself in the morning when you wake up? (laughs) I'm very excited every morning because every day is a new day for me, a new experience, meeting new people. And what's really important, you know that you're helping people and that really pulls the heartstrings because you're doing something that people need and you're able to assist them. So today we're going to be talking about some new developments at Morse Life. So tell us about those. Okay. Well... On the Morse Life campus. On the campus. On, um, I think, the second week of May, we open up our memory care residence. Our memory care residence is a 52-unit assisted living for memory-impaired residents, and we're adding 30 new nursing home beds. We took the oldest building, which is 34 years, and it was a 120-bed nursing home, and we converted it into the 52-unit assisted living for memory-impaired residents and added 30 new nursing home beds. So that's like dementia, Alzheimer's. Exactly. Which is extremely and the important. campus is so <laughs> impressive. Well, thank you very much. Come very describe proud. the campus to everybody the best okay. you can. Yeah, the campus is on thirty-seven acres of um, acres of land in on, in West it's Palm magnificent. Beach. Magnificent, it really is. And we have um, short-term rehab. We have long-term care. We will have memory care because of, we're opening that in um, May. We also have assisted living, independent living we have a full continuum of care as it pertains to home and community-based services we offer private home care we offer skilled home care we have the only aphasia program in the southeast we have meals and wheels program we do over fifty thousand meals and wheels a year 
We also have the PACE program, Program All-Inclusive Care for the Elderly, and that we are the exclusive provider in Palm Beach County. And so, for example, if a, pay, if a client who may be duly certified for Medicare and Medicaid needs services and they meet nursing home eligibility and they want to stay home, they come to us and they're picked up by our, our PACE um, vehicles. They see your doctor, they see the nurse practitioner, they get therapy, they have socialization happening in our adult daycare center. Which is amazing. And then we are responsible for all their care. So we're very excited about what we have to offer and the new services that we continue to add to our continuum. You know what's nice about them? I don't think he what's the best tonight. about them <laughs> is that you could start out with home care and then move up within Morse Life. Exactly. Because you have every provision for the elderly. Which is wonderful. It really and is. That, you know, it's, it's a one-stop shopping place. It really is. And that's what's important because I have to be honest with you. When you're a loved one and you're trying to help your mother, your father, your wife, or your husband, it is very daunting. And it's such a, an experience that you're overwhelmed. So when you have a place or an organization like Morse Life where there's one-stop shopping for all the services, you just have to call one number, and that's 561 Four seven one five one one one, and they will assist you on anything you need. You know, I like also Morse Life. You give back to the community. There's so many things that you do that's giving back. I love that about you guys. Yeah, we thoroughly enjoy it, and you have to see the great pride that the staff takes um, in in providing the care and helping people out, and that really makes you know makes you feel very proud. And, you know, I'm, I got the best job in town because okay. I'm the president CEO <laughs> watching all that goodness that people do each and every day and helping people. Do you know that any given day we touch over 3,600 people, either on the campus or within the community? Well, you know, it starts from the top down. Uh, that's very kind of you. <laughs> God, that was really good, right? Yes, you very like that. Good. Hey, let's talk about I'm sucking up to Keith. Oh, that's <laughs> wonderful. <laughs> I know where I'm going. When I'm, but let's talk about tradition of Palm Beach is on your campus. Okay. Very happy. Luxury, luxury, luxury. Yes, and it's independent and assisted living. Approximately 11 years ago, we opened up the first phase called the tradition of the Palm Beach. It's it's 144 units of independent living and assisted living. And it is luxurious. It's like a cruise ship, but on land. They have, they have over 250 activities a month taking place. They have the best food, it's gourmet food, and service. They have an attitude called can do. Whatever you ask for, it will be, it will, we will make sure you have it. So it's a great type of customer service mode and i tell you this all the staff lives and breathes customer service it's not limited just for jewish no people. it's for everybody yes because i know initially maybe it was years ago was it limited at one point no, never we are the reason why we have maintained over 85 to 90 people on a waiting list is that we do have a special niche and that is that we're the only kosher assisted and independent yes. living um in palm beach county we actually got a call from a guy in Los Angeles who wanted to try to put his mom into your facility. He looked on the website, the water, how beautiful it is there. You know, he wants the best for his mom. And he said, I called him up and they said, we'll be glad to put you on our waiting list. He said, you guys are like restaurant so, critics. Listen, I know, but you can start now. I could put you on the waiting list now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I have an in. Right, you definitely have an in. We can help you out. And you know, your your management team, when they come in every month, they all can't wait to get to work the next day. That is something. Yeah, we have, I tell you, they work extremely hard. They have great drive. They have great, we have a great team, and they love what we do each and every day helping the community. And that's extremely important. How are the new towers different from what you... Um, the new towers is great because we have finally secured the financing and we will be bu building on nine acres of land behind the original tradition of the Palm Beaches, a 182 unit independent living facility that'll be 10 stories high. And it's going to be, it's the second phase. It's always been in the planning, but the nice thing about it is that the configuration of space has changed. The community wants larger apartments. They want a rental model. They want upscale. They want an outdoor pool with a spa. 
They, and they have three different dining venues and that we're going to provide it for them. We're going to give what they've asked for. Hey, by the time you get everything built, it's time to enlarge again. Right. Am- I mean, you know what's so nice? People- he has, I know he has the vision and sees what people need and want because so many people don't want to leave their homes. But when it comes to Morris Life, you want to because it's so elegant and the services are just so amazing. You know, it's such a hard thing to have to leave your home. It is hard. And let me tell you what's really sad uh, is that a lot of seniors who have the means are in their apartment by themselves in isolation. Which is the worst. It is the worst. So I've seen it many times that someone will leave and move in to the tradition and they have had a rebirth, a new quality of life. They have a new family. They meet new friends. They may meet new lovers, and they tell you it is wonderful. So we've also know that a lot of the daughters take care of mom and dad, but because the economy now, daughters got to go to work, and that's where you and they don't have the time, right? And then we provide them not only with the facilities and with the services, but also with a sense of security. Why is it important that this new tower be on Morse Life campus? Well, first of all, it's always been part of the planning. That second of all is that the need is there. And we have responded in our entire history with the need. We, that's how we got into home health care. That's how we got into short-term rehab. That's how we started um, independent and assisted living. So the need is there. But what's really exciting is that we made a strategic decision two years ago to offer services in the South County part of Palm Beach County. And what we are offering is home care. We're offering outpatient rehab. We're offering care management services. Okay. And that's really important because we want people, we want to pepper South County, the Boca Del Rey area. We want them to get to know the quality that is behind Morse Life. So when we find a track of land, 30 to 40 acres. We will replicate the campus that we have in West Palm Beach and build it in the South County area. And it will be, uh, people will be not only yeah. amazing, but people will now come to recognize and associate quality because they have taken advantage of our home and community-based services that we offer now in the Delray and Boca area. And it'll be a natural fit. Hey, before we go to break, I got to take. We do this ask the expert, our little ask the expert show in ten different cities. So we talk to other facilities, and when we tell them that Morse Life does a show with us, everybody has heard of you around the, Texas, Dallas, Houston, San Antonio. You have a reputation, you have, which is a it's a good reputation. A good reputation, yes, yes. <laughs> absolutely. Yeah, we told us it's, it's, and you know, on Morse Life, when I. We created our vision, and our vision was to be the premier senior care organization in the country. And that was nine years ago when I was working with, when I started working with the board of directors. And I'm very happy to say that we have achieved that vision and that goal. You know, we are a five star facility, both nationally and um, in the state. We also are a Gold Seal Award winner, which is given by the Governor's Panel on Long-Term Care Excellence. Only 2% of the 700 long-term care organizations hold that coveted award. And we are one of two teaching long-term care organizations deemed by the Florida legislature. So we're very proud of our services and the accolades that we have achieved because what is really important it just says that quality is the gold standard for us. And in order to have the gold standard, we must be creative, you must have the, enough resources, and you must be able to plan and achieve your goals each and every day. Well, hey, let's go to break. We come back. I mean, this just goes by so fast. It does. But I, I, I couldn't wait till Keith came back. We'll be right back with more Morris Life. Morse Life is a nationally recognized provider of elder care 
and support services for seniors and their families in Palm Beach County. Located on the expansive Maryland and Stanley M. Katz Seniors Campus in West Palm Beach, Morse Life is dedicated to enhancing quality of life for older adults through a full range of services. Morse Life provides long-term care, state-of-the-art short-term rehabilitation, luxury independent and assisted living, memory care, and home health services. Morse Life is also the exclusive Palm Beach County affiliate for PACE, the national program of all-inclusive care for the elderly. Morse Life has been awarded the Governor's Gold Seal of Excellence and is a five-star nursing facility committed to continuous research and training that consistently delivers enlightened senior care. Morse Life also offers concierge care for clients seeking an enhanced level of private home care. For more information or a tour of the campus, please call 561 471-5111 or visit www.morselife.org And we're back here. We've we got a favorite. We, I shouldn't say that. we got so many shows, but this really is a favorite. I thought you were talking about me. <laughs> okay, you're my favorite. <laughs> we have the CEO and President Keith Myers of Morse Life. Uh, let's talk about, again, some of the amenities with the tower and the tradition of Palm Beach that you're just above everyone else. Above and beyond. Well, with the tradition and, the, of course, the tower, there'll be 24-hour tw transportation, of course. A wide variety of entertainment, not only in the facilities, but in the community. So we take people to Kravis, we take them to the various art shows, um, to the jewelry shows, anywhere they want to go, they get into our fleet. We have over 20 buses that are that sit on our campus and used to transport people. We, as I mentioned, we have, we're going to have three dining venues. Two of them will be kosher and one will be kosher style. We're having a movie theater, which is great, and it's going to have that um, stage seating, which is awesome. We have an outdoor pool. Um, with, an out, with a spa that's going to complement our indoor pool. We have a putting green. We also will have a gigantic spa and exercise venue and a very comprehensive art program in both the tradition and the one that we're building now. So when do these rentals become available? Is there a waiting list for that as well? The, the rentals, um, we start taking names on, in September because what's different is not only did we listen to our community saying they wanted larger spaces, but they wanted hardwood floors. They wanted... Um, I love it. Yeah, they wanted, uh, what do you call it, um, stainless steel appliances. They wanted granite um, countertops. So they're going to be really luxurious and really special. So they're going... We already have 14 families have signed up for it already and we have not done a stitch of marketing that's amazing I that think, really you is. know re, re, a lot of people don't know renee and i are actually restaurant critics and we have another show on another station and we specialize in fine dining i think we should go to morse life one day and just see how great the executive chef is there oh i would because i heard your food is amazing it is outrageous i would welcome you we'd love to have Host that, or it would be even better. Uh oh, he see, he's always got. Oh, that, well, we'll have him on our other show no, that we can't but, mention. But <laughs> what, what would be even better if you just pop in there? Oh, really? Because okay. Because then you know, then I had no ability to plan right. it. And you pop in, and then you make your own evaluation. Do you have an in with the security guards at the gate at all? <laughs> <Nah>. <laughs> you know what? Let's talk about heritage, because heritage is, you've, you've been around for a long time. Heritage is very important in Morse Life. Yes, it is. Um, we've been around for over 34 years, and we started as a nursing facility, a nursing home, and we've expanded because, as I mentioned earlier, earlier um, the community wanted um, short-term rehab. They wanted independent living, assisted living, home care. Um, they now the pace, memory care. So we've responded there. But what's really important is that our tagline is honoring senior living, and that is followed I love that. each and every day. And what is our underlying tradition is that we do it with Jewish um, values and all the services. We hold that very close to our heart, and it's extremely important. Now, can somebody from Broward use your facility? Come to your facility? Does they have to be a Palm Beach resident? No, it could be anybody. It could be anybody. We have people transferred f f across the nation 
to come and stay. We have people that will um, rent an apartment at Tradition for season, and once it goes back to season, they may go back to Boston or back to New York. So the snowboards affect you too? Oh, exactly. <laughs> but what's nice, they have to maintain their rent throughout the year. Oh, very good. <laughs> 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 so let's talk about the tower and the memory care facility because I know it's a very hard thing for um, children, you know, to see their adults, you know, their parents rather, have to go into some sort of assisted living facility or nursing home because of dementia or Alzheimer. So how does Moss Life kind of step in to help that? Because it's, you know, it's a hard decision right. for children to make. You have to remember that when it becomes an unsafe situation, you need to start looking for another type of initiative. Okay, for example, if your loved one who may have dementia or Alzheimer's in the middle of the night gets up and wanders out of the house, and for hours now you're going crazy trying to find them, you have the police involved, okay? Everyone is now searching. They're going up and down the different neighborhood streets. That should be the first key that you need to find a secured unit like our memory care residence. So that's really important. And that really will help the families. And one thing that we have already established are support groups. That's extremely important because you have other people in those support groups that are going through the same situation. And that's where you start bonding with them. You're learning they have the same issues. They become your friends and your family. And when something, you may have a, you know, something that breaks your heart, you reach out to them. And they have either gone through it or they help you through that situation. And this has been established six months prior to the opening of a memory care. And it is full of people. And I can tell you, we have people who can't wait to bring their loved one into the memory care residence. Um, as I told you, it's 52 units. We have approximately 80 of the units already rented. I would imagine. And I understand you have a car there. Oh yes, we do have a car there because we have a Mercedes that's gonna be parked in the back. Figures. Okay, and because a lot of uh, men want to feel the security of getting into a car and putting their keys into it so we have provided that that ability for them to do that and it's going to be in our serenity garden which is going to be in the back it's going to be secured and it's going to have other features like a water feature it's going to have a summer kitchen it's going to have different walking paths but you know some people who have alzheimer's have sundown syndrome and they get up at all hours of the night right. so this gives them the ability plus living in florida you have gorgeous landscaping and we took advantage of that i don't know if you're familiar with us but we have such a wonderful philanthropic community that support us each and every day and they have made a lot of our dreams come to fruition like the gardens like the special features that we have throughout the campus we have we believe that art we believe that music and exercise are going to be very important to this program um, and memory care. Took and advantage of the water, too. Exactly. Oh, it's just so beautiful there. And do you know, I think we will become a national model because on each of our floors, we have open kitchens, open air kitchens. So now, breakfast, lunch, and dinner will be prepared, and it will be a full sensory development area because you've, it's like you're still in your house, so you get to enjoy it. There's no other facility there or isn't. memory care that will be doing that so we're taking advantage of that and we figure it is the best way to provide the good quality of care that people have come to expect from Morse Life. We got two emails that I promised I would ask over there. Do you allow pets? Yes we do. Okay. You do. Wonderful. We allow pets. It's a little fee that comes with it but you know your, your pet is just like your loved one so you have no problem paying that additional fee. I even had an email asking me to ask you today, is there a synagogue or a, is there a place to worship at on campus? Chapel. Yes, we have two huge synagogues. I'm on bed, the tradition, and we have one at um, Morse Life Health Center, and we have two full-time rabbis. 
So we have a lot of praying going on. Is there anything you don't have? <laughs> we have they a lot have of it all. That's why they have a waiting list. <laughs> well, you've changed your the name now. It's not just Morse Life anymore. Is that right? Right. Um, the board of directors felt that as we continue to evolve and add new services and expand our continuum of care, that we needed to have a name that better characterize what we were all about. So our name now is Morse Life Health System. Wow, okay. So you won't get it mixed up. You won't think we're an insurance company. You'll know that we are a health system. So we are Morse Life Health System. And you can reach us at 561-471-5111 for any of your needs. Tell everybody where you're located as well. We are located um, in in West Palm Beach on Haverhill, and it is 4847 Fred Gladstone Drive, West Palm Beach, Florida, 33417. And what time can people come by and look at the campus? Anytime. Okay. Okay, we have, we of course we have a sales force, we have admissions people, we have supervisors. So if it's 12 o'clock in the afternoon, nine o'clock at night, we can make it happen because everyone in the community has a different time schedule, different uh, priorities. So you accommodate anybody. You got it. Perfect. They don't have a McDonald's on campus though. (laughs) (laughs) Hey, Keith, listen, it's so great having you on. Morse Life is with us every month and we we appreciate you so much, what you've done for the community and man, my hats are off. Your hat's off too, right? Absolutely. Thanks so much for coming in today. Thanks, Keith, for coming in. Well, I've thoroughly enjoyed always a pleasure talking with you. Mr. Myers, Mr. Myers. Always talking with you guys. (laughs) Thanks so much. We'll see you guys next Monday with more Ask the Experts. Peace and love, everybody. We're out. Thanks for tuning in today to the Ask the Experts show with Steve-O and Renee. Tune in every Friday from 4 to 5 p.m. while some of the top local experts in their field from Broward and Palm Beach counties educate you in the areas of law, health, financial, and home improvement. You can also call our offices at 888-574-6999 to become an expert on our show. The opinions expressed on the preceding sponsored program